Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the channel. My name is Tony. This is the 15 Minute Gamer, and today we're going to talk about mods and especially Steam Workshop mods. Now, I ran into a problem this week where I was following a Let's Play for Transport Fever 2 and all the mods were on steam but my copy is from epic so this works if it's like xbox or epic or gog or wherever you might get your games from but you want to access the steam workshop and download the mods it is super super easy before we start though don't forget to hit that subscribe button tap the notification bell smash that like button of course to get up the algorithm and comment below to let me know what you think right so I said I was looking at Transport Fever 2. I was trying to find the mods, couldn't find them anywhere. The only place was on the Steam Workshop. So I'm just going to pick a random mod. So we'll go into Dynamic Arrivals board. Now, what you're looking for is the link up here. If you're doing this from Steam itself, so once you're logged into Steam, just bring up the mod you want, right click anywhere on the page, and go copy page URL. It's all you need to do, and it'll copy that URL. Once you've done that, then you need to head over to a website called steamworkshopdownloader.io, linky in the description. This is safe, it is verified, it has a secure certification, as you can see by the lock up there, so don't worry about using it. All you do is in there, just paste, so control V or right click and paste the link, press download, It'll download the file into your download folder. And there you go. You now have that Steam Workshop mod. There you go. You can see it's popped up there. And then all you do is put that into your game. So the mod file or whatever that game uses. In Transport Fever, it is the mod file. So I hope you found that useful. That was something I didn't know and only just found out about this week. So yeah, guys, I'll catch you on the next one. Goodbye.